All right, YouTube, <clears throat> I have got another abyssal canister here to show you. This one I've actually had for a little bit, but never really got around to showing it. Uh, but I just went through my car and found some bags that will fit it. Um, now this one, I think I got it a little bit after I got the Power Groom Pet Edition. But I don't remember where. So, it's been sitting for a while, but it runs rather smooth. Uh, and it does seem to pick up pretty good, and it is rather quiet. I've never turned it on until today, so... Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and turn it on. It's going to start out on max. I don't know why, but here we go. As you can hear, it's pretty quiet. Um, we'll have it down here because we don't need it all the way up on maximum. I know it's not going to do as good as a Kirby or a Sanitaire. But it will do good on hard floors, which is one of the reasons I got it. I'm going to go ahead and go under the desk here. There's some nails and stuff under here. Which it definitely has no problem picking up. Oh, you're out of shot here. I mean, they're just little crafting nails, so of course it won't have any problem. Let's go down to that setting for the rug here. Over here to the commercial grade carpet. For this, we should just need the minimum. Seems to do pretty good. And of course on his lowest setting it's probably not gonna do so well with the larger particles. You'll have to pardon that. Well, actually. Oh yeah. I mean, it is going to have to be wiped down. Yeah, it seems to do pretty good. Oh, and speaking of Kirby's, I just trash picked or found one at a yard sale today. I don't know why I almost said trash pick. Probably because of that red bissel over there. It's going to be a parts unit for a, another one I have probably. That or I'm going to make it a Frankenstein with the blue base I have. I honestly don't know what I'm going to do with that Bissell right there yet. I remember, right? Yeah. I'm go ahead and do a little paper test with this. If 
same speed. Well, it clogged. So this has no problem with it. And it's probably because that hole is so narrow. Yeah, it's up in there, caught up in there. Well, I can say it does have its own match, it will meet. So, anyway, yeah, I'll probably end up using this in a quiet video. I'm getting a little sweaty. This garage is blazing hot. And not that that even helps anything because yeah, it just goes right back up to maximum each time. I don't know why, but yeah. Anyway, I know a lot of us don't like vessels, but this one's actually pretty good. I'm gonna hold on to it. It can be handy for certain things. Uh, yeah, Bissell OptiClean. Uh, don't remember where I got it, but all I can say is it's a pretty good cleaner. Oh, and wherever it was when I got it, it came with the attachments. We got our crevice tool, dusting brush slash upholstery tool so yeah it was a great find I don't know why it was being thrown away if it was being thrown away <laughs> it's just a theory it was a trash find or yard sale find like the Kirby I have it's a Kirby heritage I'm not going to say which heritage you're going to have to see for yourselves but yeah I mean this one Unlike the other one, we'll run without the hose being hooked up. Pretty powerful, even at its lowest setting. So, yeah. Um, I think I stuck a Eureka Type V bag in here. Yeah, it's Eureka Type V. But they fit, so I'm not going to complain. I hope no one else complains about it being the wrong bag either. So anyway, there we have uh, Bissell OptiClean. Once again, I don't remember where I got it, but... I'd say this one gets a thumbs up. So, yeah, I got this more than likely because it's a bagged Bissell canister. Unlike the Zing, which is for sale, the Bissell Zing is for sale. Um, so if anyone wants to hit me up, uh, you can go to my Facebook page, Arbach Lover 1618 on Facebook, and message me about the Bissell Zing. Uh, it's, just, it's a good little canister, handy, I'll say that. So anyway, tell me how you like this, if any of y'all liked it. Um, be sure to subscribe, visit my website, and let me know what y'all want to see, and I'll see what I can do, how I can do it, and when I can do it. So until next time, bye.